Oh yeah, we're live. How's it going, everyone? Maryland here! And that's right, it is time for more of the Ultra Moon Monotype stream. So last time I figured out what type I'm going to be playing with. Going to be playing with normal type. Oh my goodness. Normal. Wow. <laughs> that's plain, but actually I'm excited for it. I really like the normal type. It's one of my favorite types. It's very diverse as far as the moves that you can use. Which is cool. I think once we get some TMs, it'll be a lot of fun. So it's going to be tough taking on the first trial, or the grand trial, but ooh man, it'll be great. Oh man, I hope you guys are excited. I'm excited. Alright, let's, uh, let's get going here. I guess I should let you know, if you are excited, you know what to do. You know what to do. Do the things that says right there. If you're enjoying, press that like button, or if you think you're going to enjoy it. Uh, if you're not already, you should follow me on Facebook Gaming so you know what's up when I go live. And, of course, send some stars to show support. That's totally optional, but it is really appreciated. So, anyway, let's go ahead and uh, head on over to Route 2. We finally got through the tutorial mode of this game. Well, okay, I guess you never get through that. But we did at least get through that really annoying section. Ugh, that was a pain. That was a pain. So, yeah, I have these two dogs. I don't know if I should keep them both. I, like, I might as well. We're probably going to get rid of one of them for, uh, for Dunsparce. I'd like to pick up Dunsparce. I think that'd be great. Because it's one of those Pokemon you never really use. Ah, oh, shoot. I don't remember if you use a Ghastly or not. I don't think you do. I don't think so. Well, hello to everyone tuning in. I hope you have a wonderful time today. Hopefully you do. I'm looking forward to it. Yes, I am. It's actually kind of neat. Like, I've never done a monotype challenge before, but it's like, oh, this is kind of cool. You know, you have to start thinking of what you're going to do. Like, I know with this team, there will be a few trouble spots. Early in the game, dealing with Hala is going to be a pain, but thankfully the birds. I think my dual birds will help against that. But then also... Oh, do I have the experience share on? I don't remember if I do. I should probably turn it off just in case. Hey, thank you so much, Iris, for the 50 stars, saying, Oh yeah, early stream stars! Hey, well thank you so much for the stars. Really do appreciate that. Yes, I do. Uh, yeah, so that hollow fight is going to be a pain. And then, I think towards the end of the game, it's also going to be a big pain. Big pain. Alright, let's see. Yeah, I do have the experience share on. I'm kind of mixed as to whether or not I'll have it on or off. I think while I'm doing training, like dedicated training, I will. But I think while I'm just clearing out trainers and progressing with the story, I should leave it off. Uh, yeah, all right. We're still on set, which is good. So that's the pain. When you're on set, it does make it really hard to train up new Pokemon if you don't have the experience share on. And I know we're going to have some new Pokemon, but it's okay. It's okay. We'll, uh... Oh, I should use Glamour. I'm actually not sure which of the two dogs I want to keep later on. I think Glamour, just because she has more defense. Like, even though they all have negative attack natures, good dogs... At least this way, I'll have one with good defense, which is actually pretty nice. Uh, yeah, we'll fight this kid. Hey, what's up, buddy? What's going on? Preschool of Pistons, full power. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right, Dylan. Oh, a Drifloon. Oh, that's fun. This looks like a job for Carrot Cake. <laughs> Carrot Cake is actually surprisingly helpful. Alright, uh... There you are. Yeah, I gotta get Brick Break. That's gonna be really nice on Becky Back and Chester. Oh... I missed. This Hustle is a pain, though. Aftermath? Ugh. Remember saying the experience here makes it too easy? They did make it better in this game, I feel. 
due to the proportionate experience. It's not that bad, but if you are fighting everyone and catching a lot of Pokemon, then your levels will be quite a bit higher. But I do feel that they actually made the game kind of with the intention of keeping the experience share on the whole time. Out of the thousand videos you did. Yeah, probably an X and Y in Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. It's way too overpowered there. Because you get the same amount of experience regardless of what level you're at. Whereas starting with Gen 7 again... Well, actually it started in Gen 5, and then in Gen 7 they reintroduced it. It makes it so you gain experience based on the difference of your level versus the opponent's. So, it's not quite as overpowered. But it is still pretty powerful. How will it go against the Kahuna? Yeah, that's why I have two Pikapex. Because they should both evolve by the time we fight the Kahuna. So I think it'll go alright. Wow, I really like that style. You're so glamorous. Don't make it too hard for yourself. Grinding levels isn't fun either. Yeah! I know that there's going to be points in the game where I will turn it on, where I will need levels. That's why I'm not going with a hard and fast, okay, no experience share rule. But I know at this point in the game, if I leave it on, I will be way over leveled for the Kahuna. And that's not good. Don't want that. Ooh, yeah, Glamour got them baby doll eyes. Oh, man. All right, so let's see. I know that there's a few items around here. And, of course, a few trainers. There's no Pokemon I can get, because there's only, like, ghosts over here. And I think Zubat. So nothing really new to add to the team. I do want to add Dunsparce, so though. I think that'll be really fun. Ooh, Hapini. I think that would be a lot of fun on the team, just having like a super defensive tank. I think it could be great. What if we just had like a Chansey? Wouldn't even need to be a Blissey, just Chansey. With Eviolite? Mm mm. That'd be good. Wouldn't be very strong though, that's the problem. But I feel it would be nice to have. Like, I guess we could evolve it into Blissey if I wanted more offense. Where's Dunsparce at? It's actually on Route 2. It's in the northern part of Route 2. As one of the Rustling Grass encounters, or whatever you want to call it. It's a sad day when it takes three tackles to take down a Happini. Wow. Poor Glamour. <laughs> Oh, well, uh, let's see. I guess we'll grab this. Super potion. Let's try to get all the items. I don't think this totem will be that bad. If I have to catch another Furfru, uh, will it have another negative attack nature as well? I think so. What's a monotype stream? Oh, the description kind of explains it, but basically I can only use Pokemon that are normal type or part normal type. Can't use anything else. So, we'll see how that goes. I'd say normal's a good type to start with, because there's so much diversity in TMs, and there's a good selection early on in the game. Hi. Hi. Oh, man. Yeah, I really want to have two birds. We'll be alright for this island. What else am I worried about? Actually, I should probably have two birds for the upcoming totem. Not well, okay. The second totem, specifically. That one's going to be a big pain. Ugh. Actually, we're gonna need birds for the next totem after that. Like three well, not three totems. Eh, I guess three totems, because we need Brick Break for this one. Dang! 530 stars from Leah, saying thanks for keeping up the passion for Pokemon. Hey, well, you are so welcome for that, but thank you for all the stars. Really do appreciate that big service support. That is awesome. Can you trade me a scissor in the stream? No. 
This is a challenge stream. I'm not trading. Hey, how's it going, Melinda? Nice! Double paralyze in a row. Not so glamorous right now, are ya? There we go, finally. Hey, how's it going, Amanda? Glad you caught the stream, too. Okay, wow, zero attack gain. Good job. Very good job. <laughs> I'll have to compare the two dogs. I'll have to see which one's better. They both look so fancy, though. Oh, I want to use a Murkrow! If I encounter a shiny that's not normal type, will you still catch it? Of course I will. I'll catch it, I'll just trade it over to another version. In the middle of playing Breath of the Wild. Nice. I haven't played that in a while. I really need to change that, because I love Breath of the Wild. Such a good game. Such a good game. Uh, there is a Pokemon Center up here, but I think I have to go fight some stuff first. So I'll tell you what, I'm going to head back to the Pokemon Center down here. Heal up, because I don't want to be paralyzed. Are you still on Minecraft streaming too? Yes. But today I'm playing Pokemon. Another shiny Oracorio. Please no. Please no. That'd be just a little too much. Way too much. I mean, I would like it, but... I couldn't use it. That'd be the worst. All right. Let's see. I don't think Lily heals me. It'd be kind of redundant to have her heal you right outside of Pokemon Center. Like, what? Okay. Shiny Furfru with an attack luring nature. Shiny Furfru would be great. It looks really cool, Shiny. Really cool. Yeah, hi, Taylor. How's it going? I might not say hi to everyone that's in or that says hello, but know that I do see your comments. And I do appreciate that. But never take offense if I don't greet each and every one of you. Because sometimes I'm, like, right in the middle of saying something or talking, and, you know, it does kind of break from that, so, like... Don't feel bad. Instead, get in on the conversation. Talk with the chat. You guys can be really awesome if you're talking amongst uh, yourselves. That's really nice. Uh, I'm not using Pokemon Refresh, Lewis. It can get a little overpowered. When does Abra evolve? Level 16. Yeah, Shiny Furfru looks awesome. I wonder how it would look with uh, the styles, though. I haven't actually looked into that. What is Monotype? The description explains it a little bit better, but it's basically I can only use Normal-type Pokemon or Pokemon that are part Normal-type. Or whatever type it is for the Monotype. Like, I didn't know when I started the challenge. I used somewhat of a random method to determine which I was going to be using. I'm doing alright, Dennis. How are you doing? Dally bird! This thing's gonna give me some presents, isn't it? I can't wait until these things learn Headbutt. They learn it really early. There's a delay too in the video compared to the chat. That is very true. But I'm just saying that's that's what I mean. Because there's a bit of a delay. Like, if you guys are talking amongst yourselves, too, remember that there's a lot of you watching right now. And one of the things that makes chat nice is you know, talking amongst yourselves, where there is no delay. Normal ghost type. That'd be cool. That'd actually be really weird, because they'd counter their weaknesses with immunities. Because normal's weak to fighting, but ghost is immune to it. And ghost... Well, I guess ghost isn't weak to normal, but it's immune to it, too. What's my favorite Pokemon spinoff? Um... 
I don't know. Probably Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon. All right, I don't think I need to do anything else over here. And I don't think there's anything in the cave that I need. I could go there. Would I be able to use Swablu? I could use Swablu, but I could not use Altaria. But I don't think they're available in this game anyway. So unless I got it on Wonder Trade in an island, because I will allow up to 10 Wonder Trades every time I reach a new island. And if I get a Pokemon that's a normal type in that amount of time, then I can use it. So it won't be off often, but you know, it's a possibility you get something cool. Hey, you need to stop messing with that Mantine, you jerks. I haven't played Super Mystery Dungeon. Is it worth it? Some people don't like it. Some people really like it. I really like it. I actually like it better than Explorers of Sky. I think the plot was really good. I think, uh, well, okay, it starts off really slow, just so that's clear. Like, it, ugh. But once it picks up, it really picks up. And some people don't like that because there's not a lot of downtime to do, just do things at your own pace. But I liked it. Another thing I'll warn you about is it's different in how you recruit Pokemon. They all kind of have little sub-stories and stuff, or different ways of getting it, but yeah. It's also hard. Like, it's a really hard Mystery Dungeon game. I'd say it's definitely the hardest of them all. But I, I like it. Once you get past the first bits of it. All right, let's see. I know that they're, oh. Uh, hold on. All right, uh, I'm back. It was dropping some frames really fast. Sorry if it lagged out like really hardcore. Yeah, that's weird. Um, I'm having to use a wireless connection, so that might have something to do with it. Okay, are we back? Please be back. Um, hello? Okay. Wow. Um, yeah. I I don't really mean to uh, say anything too bad, but yeah, Facebook kind of just died for me for a while. Looks like we're, we're live now. Um, all right, so if any of you can see this, if you're still here, Welcome back. Uh, sorry it it crashed. It was Facebook. Like, every other site was loading just fine. But I couldn't even connect to Facebook. That was actually very strange. Um, okay, but it looks like it's still going. You didn't miss anything! You didn't miss anything. I was just going over here to pick up this item and say hi to that Pukumuku. Uh, yeah, let me, uh... Let's see... Yeah, it was very strange. I'm going to type in the chat just so people know, in case you can't see this. Alright, um, hopefully this is going to work. I really get nervous whenever things die for, like, a minute or something. That's bad. Alright, well, we'll just keep going. We'll just keep going. I'll just have to hope that, uh, we're not going to have any more issues. But if ever I see it starting to drop frames, which is what it's called, which is basically, like, it's trying to stuff too many people into a car, alright? Think of it like that. All of the frames of data... Like, you know how it's 30 frames per second or 60 frames per second? Like, all of that, if it can't push the data to the site or wherever it's going fast enough, 
then, yeah, it drops the frames. That's kind of what I mean if ever I say that. If you're like, what do you mean dropping frames, huh? What's that all about? Um, I want to use Sweetie Bun here. I don't remember what this trainer uses. But I do want to use my Sweetie Bun. But yeah, we'll just see how it goes. Hopefully there won't be any more problems today. It was really weird. Gentleman Stanley. Oh, Murkrow, okay. All right, sweetie bun, let's do this. I don't know if you'll be able to. Uh, hopefully you will. Uh, it has pursuit. How hard is that going to hit? Oh no, I should probably switch out now. Oh, actually that did, that did a lot. I might not even need to. All right, come on, sweetie bun. Oh, what is that? Get out of here with your fancy old full restore. You dare use that in front of me. I'm gonna take a chance. Oh, I use pack. Oh, Sweetie Bun hanging in there. All right, Mr. Full Restore. I'm totally going to use a potion. And then I'll be fine. All right, now let's do this. Oh, cutting it so close. There we go. All right, uh, I think there's still a few more trainers to fight. All right, well, let's lead with Chester. Need to get this bird some levels. Oh, here we go. Some ultra peoples. What's going on, my ultra peoples? They're so weird. Okay. Oh, I can get Dunsparce over here, actually. I should do that. Let's first fight you. Your sister's getting frustrated at Rotom's so sad. Well, you know, I would do something about that if it weren't for the fact that Rotom would then want to talk to me like crazy. It's like, no, I don't really want to do that. We have to establish boundaries in this relationship. <laughs> All right, let's go, Chester. Oh, you have Rock Smash now. That's actually pretty cool. Tackle, that's weak. Weak! I like how Chester's kind of like bobbing his head to the beat. How am I liking Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon? Uh, I don't really care for it as much from a storyline perspective. I feel like it's a very unnecessary game. But I do like the mechanical changes for the most part, like wormholes and, um,. Like, the selection of Pokemon's way better. Oh, thank goodness I didn't get flying, because then I could use oh, Lucha and just easy mode the game. Ooh, free stuff. Thanks for the revives. I guess those are kind of handy. Can't use them in battle. But this isn't a Nuzlocke, so I can use them. Is it better than Oras? It is better than Oras. I will at least say that. So it would be a good game to get. Um, it depends. Like, if you want to replay Sun and Moon, I, yeah, that'd probably be fine. But if you don't really care about replaying it, you're going to be playing like 90% the same game, except with a new selection of Pokemon in the wild. 
So it's very, very similar. What? Oh, do I have to do this? Ugh. All right, fine. Making me use my touch screen. How dare you? Okay, there we go. Are you happy now? Close game is awesome. It's awesome for about like two or three hours. But it took such a long time to just to get to the point where I am. All right, so we have to take on the uh, the trial. I guess I could go for it right now. I'm probably under leveled, but it's not a Nuzlocke, so this might be all right. I do have some potions. You can leave, by the way, so really what I want to do is I want to get Brick Break. All right, let's go get that. I see it! It's right there. Well, not that red one, but... The orange one, or yellow. Wow. I can't even color today. <laughs> All right, we gotta fight some rats. Which actually makes this task much, much easier. Don't miss the shiny Zygarde event. Yeah, I actually went to GameStop today and I did get the code for it, so... I'll finally have that thing. I don't really care about any of the others because I feel like I have them, but Shiny Zygarde's pretty cool. Alright, see ya, Dennis. Psyduck can learn Brick Break. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's kind of neat. Alright, I'll go back for that rat in a moment. Like, I might as well go get Brick Break right now. Oh, I guess I can't sneak past. <laughs> Darn it. But I think I'm still leading with Chester, who has Rock Smash. Which is all I need. At least for this rat. Actually, this thing might hit pretty hard. Or it's just gonna tail whip. It is a one KO! Nice! Good job, Chester! I'm proud of you. I'm actually really proud of Carrot Cake. Carrot Cake is doing really well. All right, so I need to get this thing. There we go, brick break, oh yeah. Okay, so I remember that pick a peck can learn that. Yeah, just the pick a peck. Too bad Sweetie Bun can't, that'd be nice. See, so yeah, I don't think we need Rock Smash with that. It's okay, but you don't need it. What nature did I get for Zygarde? Uh, I just got the code for it today. I don't- I haven't redeemed it yet. Almost always forget that Alolan Rad says normal and dark type. Yeah. I don't, because it's like super easy to take it out with fighting. It makes playing Moon or Ultra Moon way easier. Way easier. Alright, let's see some action, Chester. Come on. Try out the new Brick Break. Ooh, you're faster than that rat now. Nice. Okay, one more. But, I have to fight against Team Skull first. Let's see, who would be good to use against them? Maybe Sweetie Bun again? Actually, it would be a good idea to have Becky back. Just to get a little bit more experience for my birds. I'm going to need probably two of them. Oh, I should get Spiro. I didn't even think about getting new Pokemon here. Hey, how's it going, Amber? 
All right, let's go grab this item. X defense. Ooh. I should have brought Dunsparce. It actually would have been really good. Well, I'm not about to leave just yet, so... Well, aren't you being fun? Okay, here we go. Team Skull in the house. All right, let's do this. Here we go. Drowsy. Drowsy again? Did I get Dunsparce? Had to leave for a minute to do something. No, actually I forgot about that. I got too, uh, too excited to go into the cave, I guess. This is probably going to take a while. Well, maybe not. I will get Dunsparce, though. I actually think that thing could be really cool with Serene Grace. Ugh. Okay, there we go. So I definitely need to heal up Chester. Actually, what I should do is I should fight against the Eradicate with that. I think I'll do that. Because I still have a Eradicate, like a non-totem Eradicate to fight. Wow, this thing is, like, exactly the same as the original. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, well. Love that fur free. How did you style them? You can actually go to, uh... You can go to the haircut salon. There's a lady you can talk to there that'll trim your fur fru. For 500 bucks. So they look all fancy. All right, we're gonna let Becky back. Try to take this thing out. Wow! That is a big rat. That's a big rat. That's what you're gonna become, Carrot Cake. How do you feel about that? All right, let's see how good Brick Break is. Bam! Oh, baby. Yeah, so downside about the totem is I think it has plus one defense due to its aura. But we might still be able to do a good number on it. Okay, all the Pokemon have been defeated. Wonderful. And they do have two birds with Brick Break, so... That's pretty good. I think I'll lead with, um... The Chester, though. Or wait, how hard does Chester hit compared to Becky Back? It, let's take a look. 24 versus 23. Oh, alright. I see how it is. Wow, Becky Back has way worse defense. Yeah, let's lead with Chester. Alright. Ugh! All right, buddy, let's do this. Time for the first trial. Let's see how it goes. It is a relief not having to worry about Pokemon dying. <laughs> but, you know, it's fine. I think I'll give this a good challenge. All right, let's take it. This will be great for Sweetie Bun, too, once I actually get this. Like, the Normalium Z, being the first Z crystal I get, I can have some fun with that. All right, here we go. 
big rat. Oh man. All right. Come on, Chester. Do you play by Smogon rules or by your own? Uh, does Smogon have rules for in game? I don't do battles, if that's what you're wondering. Does this look like a <laughs> competitive stream? No. All right, another rat. I don't know. Hopefully you'll be able to take this thing out, Chester. Otherwise, we might have a problem. Oh, it's biting. Oh, no! That's not good. Alright, Becky back. I feel a little bad about this. Because you have a lot worse defense. But if I can just get one brick break, that'll do it. Oh, I should probably mark... Uh, Chester is out of the fight, out of commission here. All right, that's good. Good job, Becky back. You did really well. I'm proud of you. You showed off. Uh, that hurt. You're just going to go for it, though. Because this thing has Pursuit, and it has Quick Attack, so it's like, yeah. Well, there go my birds! Okay, um... I wonder if I can take it out with Sweetie Bun. There's probably no need to. Let's take it out with Glamour. We got rid of the main threat, at least, so that's good. Alright, let's tackle you. Wow, that did a lot. This is gonna be so good once you get Headbutt, which is really soon. Alright, you did it! Yay, good doggo! Should take it out with style. Uh, I could have done that. Yay, I did it! Poor Becky back in Chester, though. <laughs> but they did well. They did well. Good thing this isn't a Nuzlocke. Yeah, no kidding. That's why I felt all right about going in there. It's like, I'm not like at a really high level or anything, but I've got numbers to back it up. We'll see how that goes. So I wonder who I should get rid of. I think I need to get rid of probably Style for Dunsparce. Because I really want to use Style. Er, Dunsparce. Got the Z-Crystal of your type. Yeah, that's really convenient. That's a definite plus of playing normal type, no, uh, mono type. Ooh, great balls. Thank you for giving me more stuff. Ability for code is really good at the beginning for physicals. Yeah, no, it's great. Perfor is really solid. Like, it falls off a bit later on, but it's pretty tanky. I'm not even going to say anything to Rotom. I'm sorry. You can only get Dunsparce in the wrestling spots. Yeah, the northern part of... Actually, I don't remember if it has to be the northern part. I don't even want to think about Nuzlocking Let's Go. I'm just going to leave that to people who want to try it out. I'm not going to do it. Have fun trying to figure it out. <laughs> Alright, anyway... Oh, yeah, there's Pokemon in here. Too bad there's nothing I can catch. Man, you know what would have stunk? If I got Dragon. This would be the first time I could get a Dragon-type. And I'd be stuck with Noibat. Oh, Chester, you're back. Okay. I got healed. Wonderful. That stash, right? I think Furfru has high attack, or high defense and attack. Yeah, it has high, uh, well, actually, technically its defense isn't that high, but its fur coat ability, like, basically doubles its defense. So it is really, really tanky. 
Jeez. Wow, could you let me run away? Oh, we have access to SOS battles now. That's exciting. I could try to get, um, Capini. Well, I don't think I can get that just yet. I think I have to run into, like, Munchlax or something. Oh, there's a Noibat. Yeah, I would have had to use that if I had Dragon. And then get, um, Bagon? So basically the strategy would have been a team of Noibats. And then a team of, like, Bagon and stuff. So that would have been really boring. I would have done it. Ice would have also been a pain. You know what? I'm gonna lead with Glamour. Or at least kind of fast. You can get Noibats here? Yep. You can. At least in Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. You couldn't in the originals. But they're not very good. Uh, you say you'd allow 10 wonder trades per island? If that were the case, we could always have given you better dragon tights before you could get better options. I mean, yeah, but I would have had to get to a new island first. So, like, getting through this island would have been a pain. And it's not 10 wonder trades in general. It's, like, I have 10 chances to get something of a new type. New challenge playthrough. Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon with only Noibats. Oh, man. Hey, how's it going, John? Yay, tell me how to use Z-Moves. I really need more tutorials, because I haven't played this game so many times. Thank you, Professor Kukui. Doggo. I'm gonna fight a doggo with another doggo. Alright, here he goes. I do like how they changed the font for Z-Moves, though. I didn't like the, the look of the old ones for some reason. Like, it just kind of bothered me, but okay. This one's better. Wow, you really wrecked that Growlithe! How do you feel about yourself, Kakui? Neither of you are normal types. Okay, go try to find someone. Oh, I can get Spiro too. I wonder if I should swap out a like Becky back for Spiro. Nah, you know what? I think I'd rather have two Trumbeak. Okay. So I need to get Dunsparce. And that's in the uh, the rustling grass. Aw, cutie fly! Would have been really interesting to use fairy for a monotype, because then it'd be like cutie fly, um, flabebe. What else? Cottony if I was playing sun? That would have been cool. We used two Firo in a row. Oh, it's a snake. Yeah, but I mean, I've also used Trumbeak and two cannon. I used a lot of birds in the last run. Like, we're going to need birds for this. Birds are going to be very important for the first few uh, trials. Oh, actually, I forgot about the fire trial. I was thinking of Lurantis. Oh, why am I running around in here? Always do another monotype in the future with a different type. That is correct. This might not be the last one that I do. I might, like, after we beat this, if you guys really enjoy it, I might go through another type. Like, we'd exclude normal from the mix. we do something different. Hey, how's it going, Yanni? All right, let's see. See ya, Amber. Doggo! See, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna run away from you. I'll let you live. I won't demolish you with a Z-move. Ooh, 
Ooh, I should put some Z crystals on my Pokemon, though, because I don't really have items on them. That would be a good idea. Alright, let's see. Let's do a Fire Run of Diamond Pearl. Yeah, that sounds great. 100 stars from Trina. Thank you so much for the stars, saying, Hey, Maryland, excited to see how the rest of your challenge pans out. Sending you the best of luck and some stars, of course. Yeah, well, thank you so much for the stars. I really do appreciate that support. Uh, what was I just about to do? Oh, yeah, Z crystals. That's right. Let's do that from the, the bag. All right, so... I mean, we might as well just slap them on literally everyone. Oh, that's gonna be good with Sweetie Bun. With that Z splash right now. Oh, yeah. Oops, yeah. Alright, would you like to switch the two items? They're the same items! It's kind of silly. Okay, there we go. Let's have some fun with this. Oh, man. Uh, you wouldn't go through with only two Pokemon. You'd go through with, like, multiple Ponyta. It's like an army of horses. Because that's also something you need to consider. Like, you don't need to go through with just one of each species. At least as far as I know, I don't think you have to. I kind of like the idea of having other Pokemon of the same species and just, like, seeing what different things you can do with them. Or just having multiples for a fight. Like, I think that'll be great for, uh... Quite a few fights here. That's why I really do want to use both of the burbs. So I think I have to go in here and leave in order for the rustling grass to appear. Because Dunsparce is kind of uncommon here. So I would like to get it. Nope. Wrong snake like thing. Uh, you know what's going to be a pain is that the Dunsparce doesn't have uh, Serene Grace. That'd be bad. <laughs> Nurse Joy must be like, what are you doing? And also try for Dunsparce at the Southern Patch. I feel like this goes just as fast as it would going over there. There it is! Nice! Alright, let's get this done, Sparse. Alright, uh, it's pretty bulky. I think it'll survive a tackle. Obviously. Oh boy, here goes the rollout. That's actually going to be pretty nice, having a rock-type move. Will I get Smeargle? Uh, I don't really need Smeargle for anything right now. I'll probably go back and get it later. Because I can't think of anything I'd want to sketch. Well, that was easy. Alright, great. Uh, I want to call him You're Done, but I want a funny way of, like, spelling it out. There we go, there's Headbutt. Good dog. We're getting rid of Tackle because that's garbage. Garbage! Now you'll hit, like, a truck. A very glamorous truck. Okay, what does it say about Dunsparce here? Adamant and Serene Grace. That would be nice. I'd be very happy with that. When it sees a person, it digs a hole with its tail to make it escape. If you happen to find one, consider yourself lucky. Such a weird looking thing. It looks like a French pastry of some sort. Alright, let's give you a nickname. We're gonna call you... You're done. You're done! Alright, let's take a look at you. 
Oh, Serene Grace. There we go. All right. I mean, not like the best nature in the world, but it's passable. I'll take it. Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to get rid of Style. I'm sorry, Style. But I think we're going with Glamour for the extra defense. Okay. French pastry should have been its name. I mean, I guess. All right, what is preventing me from putting this 3DS down? I got cords all over the place, and it's really bothering me. All right, so sorry, Style. So we have your Dunn. The Dunn Sparse. Great. You're done! <laughs> uh... All right, so I might as well give the Normalium Z 50 stars from Miranda, saying I've been watching or I've been nonstop watching the YouTube archive videos of yours. It's given me a new way to play my older Pokemon games. Thank you for all the entertainment with your videos. Well, thank you so much, Miranda. I'm glad to hear that you've been enjoying my videos and that they've helped kind of like inspire you to play some of your older games. It's actually a great thing to do with older games, is, you know, find like challenges or things to do with them, like. You know, maybe this will get people wanting to do mono-type runs. Or even mono-locks on uh, other games. Alright. So I definitely need to give you some kind of move. Let's see. Confide. That's the only thing you can get. That's a shame. You can't even get work up. Ugh. All right, well, at least we got that thing. Now, do I want Spiro? Unfortunately, Carrot Cake is not going to be the most useful thing right now, but she is going to be helpful later. So it's like I kind of want to train her, but it would be more practical to have more birds. Because I feel like having uh, three birds right now would be ideal, especially with Hollow right around the corner. Okay, let's see. I guess we have to go over here anyway. Too bad I can't get Rufflet. Ugh, so bad. Um, I don't think there's anything else of interest over here. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. All right, Ian. Psyduck. Oh, great. That's fun. Alright, Glamour, can you handle this thing? I remember this Psyduck always being a pain. It hits so hard. Oh, but I have Headbutt, so that might work out. I guess I do have a Z-move, too. Ooh, yeah. Alright, well, how is that doing? That's fine. I like the name. <laughs> You're done. I think that turned out great. I think the two ends make it. Oh, man. Okay, let's see. So, there's this area over here. But I don't think there's anything I need. Yeah, if I had ice, I would have had to deal with, like, Delibird and Smoochum. So this, are, this would be where I'd be getting my first ice types. All right, we're gonna train up your done. Gotta give him some use at some point. Hey! Well, I gotta watch out for fighting types too. I mean, I I do have some switch-ins, but they don't resist fighting, and they don't have a lot of defense. So I just have to be careful. Hey, Catalan with 50 stars. Thank you so much for the stars. I really do appreciate that support. Alright, let's roll out. Let's see how that goes. Ugh. This might not have been the best idea.
Maybe. No, I think you're gonna be done. You're done. Uh, oh. Such disappointment. You came so close. Alright, well, I guess we'll use... Uh, let's use Sweetie Bun. Are these stars like bits on Twitch? Yes! They are very similar. But if you get like a ton of them, it's actually a better deal. Which I actually really like. Okay, I have to go heal up. Oh, I need to probably do that. I am keeping track of total number of deaths. Even though, you know, I can still revive them and stuff. But so far we're at 9, I believe. Now, obviously that's a little skewed because I'm taking way more risks than I would if this were just a standard challenge. But, you know, it's, it's alright. I figure it makes sense to at least keep track. Alright, you're back. Welcome back, you're done. Oh, I gotta get you a, a good move. I don't know what you learn. We'll find out, though. Thank you for streaming at a time when I needed a good laugh. Well, hopefully I'll give you a few good laughs. Oh! If not, I'll give you a few good birds. We got so many. Oh, yeah, Spiro. Oh, do I want to go that route or not? I know it gets plucked, but... I don't know if it's going to be any better or worse, because the thing with Becky Back and Chester is they will both evolve by the time I get to Hala, probably. Three times, okay. I mean, I might as well go for it. It's fine. It's, like, it's usable. I just don't know if I want to swap out a bird, if I want to swap out Carrot Cake, or if I just want to go, you know, with what I have right now. I want to keep Sweetie Bun on the team, because she at least gets happiness. And she's going to need that. She's also going to be really good once we get off of this island. Because Elemental Punches. Mmm. That's going to be amazing on her. And I don't think anyone else can do that right now. We're definitely going to go surfing. Alright, so we got a Spiro. What does it say about this thing? Alright, due to its short wings, it can't fly long distances. It wanders around restlessly and pecks at bug Pokemon. Alright. Um, let's call you Captain. You're Captain Jack Spiro. I don't think that one's ever been done before. I could just call you Captain Jack. I think we're going to do that. Alright, you're Captain Jack. Well, let's take a look at your nature. You might have, like, a really good nature that's like, oh, heck yeah. Uh, oh, heck no is more like it. Ooh, yeah, you are not the captain anymore. We're sending you to the box. Modest. Huh. Huh. All right. Uh, oh, you dropped your beak. That could actually be really good on Chester or Becky back. Maybe I should fight another one to get one more. Or wait, don't I get one for free here? Yes, I do. Well, what's the point? Oh, yeah, I get healed over here. But you know what? I also get the Soothe Bell. And even though I do want to hold on to... Wait, is this it? Yeah, this is it. Even though I really would like to have, um... Sweetie Bun with Z-Splash, I really would rather evolve you first. Like, you're not going to be that useful right now. Um... There we go. Oh, whoops. My bad. There we go. Now we're good. 
Okay, maybe I'll give this to Becky back. Oh, what? What normal moves do I even have? Z work up. Yeah, I think I'd rather rather do that. Can she even use the Soothe Bell? Yes! Soothe Bell does work, even with Klutz. Same with experience share in the old games, and also uh, Z Crystals do work with Klutz as well, so don't worry about that. Alright, well at least I get some free healing over here. That's kind of nice. So I wonder if I should make it a challenge to actually catch all of the Pokemon that are of the type I need. Because that could be interesting. It's not necessary, but it means I could go back and get Smeargle. Alright, uh, so... You think we're gonna run into Shiny Oricorio? The Oh, I have to deal with the Furfru in here. That's a tough fight. What the heck? All right, well, I guess I'll take that. Mm, should I turn on experience share? Since I get this bonus, it would be nice for the holo fight. I think I'm gonna leave it off. I actually would kind of like to be at a little lower level. For the beebs! I don't believe there's any normal types over here. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's you, you're done. I feel so weak. My Pokemon are only around the levels of the wild Pokemon around here. Netball. Mm. Oh, there's Oratorio. Actually, maybe I should knock this thing out, because it gives a lot of experience. It's probably going to take me out, though. Okay, how hard is your pet hitting? Uh, ooh. Come on, you're done. Go for it. You have the advantage this time. Maybe. Uh, there you go, you got the crit, good boy. Wait, why did you get boosted? I didn't catch you here. Oh no, from the power, that's right. Okay, so Screech is pretty good. I guess we'll get rid of Spite. Screech could actually be pretty nice. Dang, that was a lot of experience. Okay, uh... I'm just gonna use some potions right now. I know that Lily heals me, but... Since I have this boost and I really want to go over here, if I run into another Oracorio, I would very much like to fight it for experience, because that'll get Yordan caught up pretty well. Uh, I mean, I guess I could roll this thing out. Although, if it has stun sport, that's gonna ruin my day. Well, we'll do it anyway. Absorb. Yeah, this is a good training spot. Oh, yeah! Defense curl and rollout. That's right. I forgot that that is a combo in this. It's been such a long time since I've used Rollout. Yeah, there's really no reason not to use Defense Curl on the first turn. Actually, maybe... Maybe I'd still end up doing more damage. Because I don't want to skip straight to 60. Yeah, I think in this case, if I don't need the defense boost, I'll just go straight for it. So I'm doing 30 and then 60. As opposed to raising my defense and then doing 60. 
Like, I think it, it averages out a little bit better. Uh, you know what? You're level 12. You need to get Chester leveled up. Actually, I really need to get Becky back and Chester up to 14. That's practically a requirement. Oh, you fight me with Oracorio, don't you? I really want to fight you with, uh, Jordan. But I need to heal up first. All right, Lily. Heal me. Thank you. All right, let's go do that. Because Jordan will do a pretty good job. Actually, maybe I should switch. I think that's a good idea. Let's see if I can do that and get, like, a lot of experience. Wait, who am I leading with? Am I still leading with Jordan, or did I switch out? I don't remember. Oh, well, we'll find out. I think I switched, right? Okay, yeah, we got Chester. So I'll see if I can switch to Becky back and to everyone else, just to get as much experience from this fight as possible. Because that'd be cool. Wow. Uh, should switch to Sweetie Bun. That's just so weird. All right, we're gonna tail with you. Just so it goes a little bit easier. Okay, now, uh, I love with Chester. All right, now let's send out you're done. I think it might be a good idea to use uh, Defense Curl. Yeah, we'll start with that. Or will probably be fine. Oh, uh, it'll be fine. I want the extra damage, because I don't want it to use Growl or anything. It's doing 10 with Pack. Yeah, I'll be fine. Okay, I don't think I'll take it out in this hit, but probably the next hit. There we go! Alright, now we get all the experience for everyone. That just seemed like a good idea. Mud Slap. Um, I don't really need Pursuit, but it would be nice to have another Dark-type move. I think I'll get rid of Pursuit. Having a Ground-type move right now would be nice, especially one that lowers accuracy. Like, that could really save me in a few fights. Like, totem fights. Even though it's dirty. Can you catch Noibat in the cave? Not in this cave around here, but you can catch Noibat in the, uh, Verdant Cavern. Uh, I don't need Pursuit. <laughs> Who needs an experience share? Ooh, Becky Back wants Supersonic. Uh, you know what? Becky Back, I don't remember if you had a higher special attack. I think you did. Let's get rid of Growl. We'll have you with Supersonic, and we'll keep Chester without Supersonic. Just so they kind of have some difference. Wait, so Becky Back's at a higher level. Oh my. Alright. Oh, I still have more experience power. That's cool. I should go fight another, uh, another Oracorio in the wild. Because I really want to get Becky back and Chester leveled up to 14. I'm going to need to do that before the trial anyway. 
but since I have this this bonus power all right so we'll lead with Chester switch for Becky back might as well switch around as much as possible like this is gonna run out soon did the lady vanish she did just teleported away Use an escape rope or something. Alright, let's see. Yeah, we should have time to fight one Oracorio. Or maybe two if it calls for friends. There we go. That's what I want to see. Alright, Oracorio. Ugh. Let's do this. Uh, actually, do you have anything that might... No, you don't. Alright, so we'll switch out for Becky back. I love that these things evolve at level 14. That's really early. Becky back will probably evolve after this fight. What the heck? Oh, this is gonna be a pain. I'm not ready for this. Yeah, don't call for help too soon. Uh, next up... Let's send out Sweetie Bun, I guess. We'll get Sweetie Bun out before there's two on the field. Because then there's no way I'm able to switch out Sweetie Bun. I should probably defense curl beforehand. Uh, who else wants some experience? Carrot Cake, maybe? Actually, Carrot Cake would be good with uh, Tail Whip. Especially if this Oracorio calls for help. Could do it again. Yeah, let's do it again. You can take hits really well. I'm actually surprised this thing has better defense than I thought. Like, it's not great, but nothing is at this point. Other than, you know, Glamour. That's kind of a given. I really should be leveling up Glamour, too. I'll probably have to switch out for, gra for Glamour. Almost like Glamour. Uh, if things get rough here. Oh, you didn't really do that much. Let's just roll out. Just to minimize the amount of turns you can use Growl on me. Wow. Alright, well, no friends, but that's okay. Should still get a good amount of experience. Yeah, 400 almost. That was a nice little training session. Chester, 13, wants to learn supersonic, but I'm going to say no to that. Sweetie Bun, 13. Baby doll eyes, aww. Um... I feel like I could get rid of Defense Curl for that. We're going to be replacing a lot of these moves anyway. So yeah, let's do that. Because then it kind of helps the rest of the team. So if we're in a totem fight... It's not just Sweetie Bun there. Okay, there we go. Becky back. Level 14. You know what that means. It's time for some evolution. Becky back is evolving. Oh, man. Yay! There we go. We got Trumbeak. Yay, Becky back. All right, let's see what it says about her. Want to evolve Sweetie Bun before it missed return. Doesn't it get return when it evolves, though? Uh, from its mouth, it fires the seeds of berries it has eaten. The scattered seeds give rise to new plants. Wonderful. Okay, it's actually really nice. They both have skill links, so that'll be really helpful later on. Okay, Roto Power wore off. That's a shame. Um, okay. So we need Chester still in the lead. That's fine. Because I do want to get Chester to 14. Then these two can probably handle... The, uh, ooh. 
They can handle, uh, Hala. Trying to get that beak blast. Well, that's gonna be a while. Oh, you calling for help. I see how it is. Ugh. All right, well, I was hungry for some bugs. Wow, another shiny Zubat. That's crazy. Nice job, Nibs. All right, you know what that means. We get another evolution. Oh, yeah. Chester is evolving. Yeah, this will be way better than Spiro. Spiro is really good, though. But for right now, I think this is the way to go. Birds of a feather. Now, where the heck do I get Pluck? I feel like I get that pretty soon. It would be nice to have it. Okay, well, that was the main thing I wanted to accomplish here. I guess I'm gonna run back to heal. Oh, no! You accidentally killed it! That's not good! Oh, dang. I'm so sorry. So sorry to hear that. Okay, look at them birds. I also like how Sweetie Bun looks like she's, like, kicking and punching. She's trying to be all tough. Uh, Glamour. Need some levels on Glamour. I should probably use Screech on that dog, realistically. Yeah, what I might do... I actually don't know what I'm going to do. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Luck is in Paniola Town. I feel like I get a stronger move than Peck. I don't remember why. I just seem to recall it. I mean, I'll settle for Aerial Ace. Arp, arp. Okay, Glamour. Uh, let's actually run. Not really worth my time. We can figure out how to beat this dog. It's not really a problem. Oh, it's so hard to see that at night. Okay, Seaward Cave, escape rope. Lovely. Do I need anything over here? I don't think so. I don't think there's anything in the cave that matters to me. Aw, Smoochum. I still had this feeling like I was going to have ice for my type. Like, that would have been really awkward, but really interesting. Normal's actually a very good type. In my opinion, at least. Just because you have one thing you have to worry about, and that's basically it. What does skilling do? It makes it so if ever you have a move that hits multiple times, then it will always hit five times. So something like Fury Attack will always hit five times in a row. Wait, what? Oh, that's so weird. I thought I could run around that thing. Was I mashing A and I talked to it? Ah! <laughs> I love that pose. It's just like, <laughs> oh. all right, let's do this. I was thinking I could explore the cave first, but no. Hey, why does your dog look fancy? This is what we do here on Earth, okay? Um, it's just gonna growl me, isn't it? All right, let's just headbutt. Oh, it's gonna baby doll eyes. My bad. I don't have any special attacks. I just realized that. So what we have to do, we have to screech this thing. Because otherwise it's just going to growl and baby doll eyes. And it's just so frustrating. Yeah, that's what really stinks about normal type early on. There's nothing for special. Oh, I guess I have echoed voice. That would actually be very smart, wouldn't it? 
Well, I'm already committing to this. Let's just see how it goes. Oh, whoa! All right, nice crit flinch. Very nice. All right, Becky back. Oh, you got sand attack too. This is just gross. All right. Orf, orf. <laughs> this thing's such a pain. I know I have Brick Break, but honestly, I feel like Echoed Voice is going to be a little more. Because this thing is pretty... It's, a, it's really bulky all around, actually. Yeah, this isn't good. Oh, Becky back! No! Alright, um... Should they follow up with Chester? Yeah, we might as well. Becky back doesn't have very good defense, so maybe Chester will do better. I could try Brick Break. I guess realistically you haven't used Growl yet, so... This might actually do more, because I did get a Screech in. Yeah, that was good. Since I got the free switch... You're done leveling up. Glamour leveling up as well. <laughs> this song, though, this will be the only time you hear this longer than only 40 seconds. Yeah. Yeah, that fight does take a while. All right, well, good fight. Or Becky back. She didn't deserve it. Okay, uh, I could heal, but I just wanna... Is there anything in this cave? Oh yeah, you know what, there is. There's the expert belt you can pick up now. You had to wait earlier in order to get Tauros, but now you can just pick it up, which is really nice. More smoochum. Arf, arf. You know what? I might as well knock you out. Just leave Nebby behind. Hey, Nebby can take care of itself, alright? Alright, expert belt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, with all that normal type action going around, right? Well, that'll be good on uh, Sweetie Bun. Actually, it's not going to be good on Sweetie Bun, because Sweetie Bun's going to have the Z, uh, the Normalium Z. Alright, let's open the bottle. Cool. Side quest stuff that I don't care about. Lovely. My favorite. Alright, a dive ball. Is that it? Is that it? Hmm. Actually, I might still want the expert belt. Because I might not want to use these splash all the time. Golly bird! Yeah, I'm really glad I didn't get ice. Even though I do think it would have been fun, I think that that would have been very painful working with Delibird and Smoochum for a lot of the game. Because there's not a lot of ice types early on. I mean, thankfully it's better than a lot of games where there's literally nothing, like literally, but it's still not a lot. I think the next ice type I get would be... Uh, I want to say, like, Snover and Alolan Sandshrew? Put the Expert Belt on one of the birds for Hala. I mean, I have two sharp beaks for them, so it's not really necessary. I could. But the sharp beak will really do the same thing. It wouldn't be bad on Carrot Cake, just in case I run into, like, a Psychic type. You know, I guess I'm actually at a decent level right now. I was thinking I was at a little lower level than I really am, but it's actually fine. I could probably take on Hala right now. The question is, what do I want to take out How with? Because he has a Noibat now. I guess we should probably leave with, like, Carrot Cake. Carrot Cake hasn't gotten a lot of action lately. Or I could leave with Sweetie Bun. All right, I'm gonna go back for Nebby. Actually, what I could do... Ooh, I could bite you for some experience. I don't think you give a lot, though, right? 
Most babies don't. Oh, actually, I wonder if I can get Happini in here. I don't really need one right now, but that would be very nice to have Happini. And then eventually Chansey. And I probably would go with Blissey, just because otherwise fights are going to take an eternity. Oh, I wonder... You know what? I have this feeling like if I use an escape rope, it's just going to take me out there. So it's going to be a pain. No Happini. I know that they summon Jinx. I feel like they do have Happini, though. I mean, I could always find out. But I guess it's not a huge deal. Maybe I'll just quick attack the next one. Wow. Uh oh. Bleh. No help for you. Oh no. Ugh. You're still calling for help, huh? Okay. Uh, I do want to knock this thing out. I don't know how much experience I'm going to get. Oh, yeah, yeah. Happini would be in an SOS encounter. That is true. That's what I meant. But yeah, if you said, uh, it's not there. Yeah. Only for SOS. That's what I was talking about. It's all good, though. Yeah, they can only show up in SOS encounters, as far as I know. Oh, you are cutting it close, Carrot Cake. Will you actually hit this thing? Nope. Good job. Ugh. All right, where's my mouse? All right, there we go. I mean, not the one that just got knocked out. My computer mouse. Uh, I guess we'll send out Sweetie Bun, then. Is this challenge hard for you? Just asking. It's not that hard. Like, I wanted to do something a little bit more fun than, like, brutally hard. So since I don't have to worry if things die, it's not, like, it's a lot less stressful. There may be some fights that are going to be very brutal. Uh, so it's, it's kind of a challenge thinking of what I want to do in certain fights. But it's different. Like, I've never done a monotype. I've usually been more into Nuzlocke's. But so much of them is just, like, grinding over and over and over again. Which I just personally got a little sick of. Uh, I guess I have Mud Slap. Oh, that's going to take ages. Alright, let's send out Glamour. Wow, I really gained a lot of levels in the, uh, the meadow. Oh, I guess this is probably going to knock you out, too. Whoops. Oh, wow. Oh, well. Hey, how's it going, Leah? How you doing? Okay, Nebby, let's get out of here. Oh, you know what? I didn't even think of who I'm going to have in the lead. Because my Pokemon are going to get healed, at least. But then I believe I immediately have to fight against Hao. Yay! I'm healed! I can use my Pokemon again. Hooray! Okay, uh, there we go. It's my favorite normal type Pokemon. Actually, it's one of them on my team right now. It is Baneri. Baneri is one of my all time favorite Pokemon. I like it even more than I like uh, one of my other favorites, Lot Bunny. Which I really like. I like rabbits a lot. They're really great. And Baneri is just like so cute. Oh, you lead with your starter? Okay. Oh, yeah, I have Carrot Cake out. That's right. All right, well, let's do this. That's fine. Oh, but you probably have a fairy move, don't you? 
Oh, man. Well, I bet you you can handle it. Oh, you have a berry? Okay. Found a chart that tells you how viable a monotype is in each game you're playing? Sadly, only have the aura, so it's very interesting to look at. Could I post it for anyone that's interested? Uh, yeah, I'm not entirely sure if it will allow a link, but see if it will. I would totally be fine if, uh... Oh man, this is actually kind of mean. Uh... I guess I'll sign out Glamour. Yeah, in this game, how's Poplio is female? Any of his other starters are male, but... His Poplio and all of its evolutions are female for some reason. I wonder what X and Y would be like for a monotype run. I actually think it'd be a lot of fun, because one thing I love about X and Y... Oh, now you use the fairy-type move. That's silly of you. One thing that uh, I've noticed about it and that I love about it is there's so many Pokemon. 450 or so. It's an excellent selection. Absolutely excellent. Okay, um... I mean, I might as well send out Sweetie Bun. How is way lower level than I thought he was. Pokemon Go, I got a shiny Larvitar in the Community Day event. Nice! I wish I would have gotten one. I actually went out for it. Because I didn't have any streams or anything going on. And I caught 55 Larvitar and I didn't get a single shiny. Which I know it's not like a ton, but... I don't know. I would have liked to have gotten one. Pikachu. Pika! All right. Oh, you don't you don't have your Z move. That's right. Nice crit. Good job, sweetie bun. Oops, sorry. Sorry for bumping the mic. No, I got paralyzed. That's not good. But will I be able to take this thing out? Uh, no. The worst is Gen 1, remakes included. Yeah, that does sound about right. I don't think this is going to knock it out. Nope. But you might be able to get it with this one. Come on. There we go. There we go. Hope you'll evolve the Larvitars with the candy. Yeah, hopefully I'll be able to get a Tyranitar out of it. I was stupid. I didn't use the Pineapple Berry because I haven't played Go in like a year and I forgot you could do that. But, oh well, I still have plenty. I haven't gotten a Tyranitar yet. Can't wait for trading. I got a whole bunch of Kangaskhan. Thanks to my trip to Australia last year. Did I get healed from that? Or did you guys just, like, rush off? Oh, I did get healed. You're actually really nice. Oh, uh, who is falling behind in levels? I know that there's someone with a Growlithe up ahead. And it has Intimidate. Uh, I should be fine with Carrot Cake. Have I fought everyone? Oh, Roost! That could be really nice for both Chester and Becky back. Or maybe one of the two. Alright, uh, I think the only trainer is this guy, and I think he has a Growlithe. But I think the other guy has a really annoying Butterfree. But I might be able to have Yordan handle it. We'll have to see. I guess I do have some birds in the back that could also handle it. There's the Growlithe. Yeah, I've never gotten a Shiny in Pokemon Go. Can you do the Hollow Fight today? That will be nice. I should be able to do it today. Should be able to. Like, I'm at a good level. And... It's like the next thing I have to do, so that's really nice.
<laughs> Today I learned Oranguru. Oranguru is normal type. I thought it was psychic only. No, actually, that's one of the Pokemon I am kind of interested in using. I think it would be cool to use that. Actually, you know what? I should really be using Chester here. Hopefully I can take this thing out. Uh, do I have... I think I have work up on it. Sorry, buddy. I'm trying to get shiny type null sometimes. No, I'm putting that one on hold. I'll go back for it at some point, but I have to do the uh, episode RR first. But I'd rather just do uh, wormhole hunting. Oh, you have two Pokemon. I forgot about that slow poke. Ugh. Ugh, maybe I should have led with carrot cake. Is there still time? Probably not. Um... Yeah, this is bad. You know what? I'm gonna save you. Let's send out Glamour instead. Hopefully this fight doesn't take a million years. I feel like it took an eternity in one of the playthroughs I've done to this. What the heck? That is bulky. All right, I could use some flinches, yo. There we go. That's what I want to see. I want to see more of that, please. Oh no, my dog is gonna be put to sleep. Actually, that sounds really bad. I mean, it's gonna fall asleep. No glamour, we're not putting you to sleep. Don't worry. <laughs> You're too glamorous for that. Oh, my poor dog. Oh. Butter for you. This thing. This thing is a pain. Uh, let's see. I wonder if Yordan can handle it. Because I know it has Roost. Well, it didn't get the boost. That's good. Uh, we are just going straight for rollout. Oh, yeah. All right, hit it one more time. Just like the song. This Butterfree was a pain to fight with my Mono Water team. I bet. This Butterfree is a pain to fight with a lot of things. Why can Furfru learn Sunny Day? I don't get it. Yeah, that is a little odd. Oh, come on! Oh, well, I think we got it. Okay, good job, you're done. Lammer wants Tail Whip. Um... I feel like I'd rather have Growl for Totem Fights. I could get rid of Sand Attack. Oh, wait, I don't need Growl and Baby Doll Eyes. Um, let's get rid of Baby Doll Eyes for Tail Whip. Oh, this goes first. You're really fast as it is. Like, Growl is just better in Totems. Okay. So... Give me that TM, please. Why, thank you! That seems like it'd be really good on Becky Beck. Or Becky Back and Chester. Wait, can your Dunn learn that? That'd also be good on your Dunn. I think it can. Oh, yeah, it can. Nice. Um, let's see. What would I want to get rid of? Probably Work Up. I feel like I haven't used that at all. And Echoed Voice. Well, I guess I don't need Echoed Voice. Hold on. What's your special attack? I think it's higher, right? No, it isn't. I could have one of you with Echoed Voice. Eh, 
we don't really need it. Do we? That's really low special attack. I'm gonna get rid of it. I think Roost might be handier. Although I guess I can use items, so it doesn't it's really kind of a moot point. Uh We'll just do that. What games am I playing on my own time? Uh Xenoblade Chronicles 1 I've been playing a lot of. Much else, actually. Okay, so I guess uh, next up we have to fight the the Kahuna. Oh man! All right, so let's see. Theoretically, I should be able to handle that with Chester and Becky back. I will get healed before the fight, which is kind of nice. If this doesn't go well with these two, that could be a problem. That could definitely be a problem. But I do have two birds. So hopefully these birds work out well for me. All right, here we go. Let's fight against Hala. Uh-oh, I'm out of water. Out of water, what do I do? I think I get healed beforehand. I'm almost positive I do. All right. Here we go. I like that look. I really got to swap out that backpack. You know, maybe I don't get healed. <laughs> I'm actually thinking I don't now. Uh-oh. This is gonna be fun. I don't think I do. I thought they healed me beforehand, but nope. Oh well, we'll make the best of it. Honestly, I think we'll be fine anyway. Uh... Let me check. Oh, I do. Okay. I could have sworn I did, so... That's fine. All right, this thing has revenge and it hurts. Oh my gosh, that didn't do very much at all. Good night. Well, okay. That seems fair. All right, uh... You... You need to tone it down a little bit. Let's growl. Oh, that's great. Nice. Just what I want. I want to get crit. Yeah, I honestly feel like Hala got a huge buff in this. Because that Machop is brutal with focus energy and especially revenge. Um... I'm gonna go for the flinch. I know I'm just giving it fodder for revenge, but yeah. Hey, at least you took it. That's pretty good. I'm not sure if this will knock it out though, but I don't really have any other options. Oh, it did. Nice. All right. Well, that was pretty good. Oh, great. It's Kerbrawler. Um, you know what? I would love it if you just use your Z move and we just went about our business. I should probably tail whip it, though. Or actually growl. I probably could have healed. But I think it's going to take me out with this anyway. Oh, it's going to power up punch, too. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Here we go! Oh, poor Glamour. Oh, man. All right. Um. Well, this is the thing that I would want to use you against, so I guess we'll go for it. That power-up punch is brutal, though. 
Uh, that's not good. That's really not good. Um, I should have used Brick Break, actually. Well, maybe you want Potion. That's what I'm worried about. I don't want him to use a Potion right now. But I think you're just outside of Potion range, thankfully. Yes! Way to go, Chester! Alright, Makuhita. This is uh, actually kind of dangerous, because I am leered. So, you're probably going to fake out. Let's just go ahead and switch out. Yeah. That's what I thought you were going to do. Uh, we really need to contribute to this with Screech. Sand attack. Oh, I see how it is. Um, okay. In that case... I should screech one more time. How am I going to send out another Pokemon? I can't really right now. Uh. Uh. Defense girl? This is going to hurt. Hmm. Yeah, five times every time. Hello. That's just great. I think I'm going to have to just say goodbye to Yordan. I'm sorry. But anyone else is going to get hit really hard by this arm thrust. And I just, I can't do that. Okay, but you haven't screeched, so I think Chester will do okay. All right, Chester. Let's go ahead and peck this thing. I don't think it's going to want it KO, though. Uh, oh, it did. Nice. Nice! There we go! Whew. Yeah, that's a, that's a tough fight for a normal-type team. Thank goodness for birds. But even they didn't do very much. Like, really. Probably would have been better with Spiro when thinking about it. Oh, well. We did it. We did it! Yay! Hooray, we get the fighting Z crystal that we're probably not going to use. Although it wouldn't be bad. I guess I can still use the other type Z crystals. Use that with Brick Break. Have Chester come in with an all-out pummeling? Oh, yeah. Thank goodness it didn't go south. Yeah. I was kind of worried it would. I wasn't sure, but... I was definitely a little nervous. I just didn't want anything to happen to my sweetie bun. Like, I really want her to evolve. Oh yeah, I get Tauros now. Ooh, now the question is, should I get a Munchlax? Use Snorlax, that could be pretty good. Actually, Snorlax would be a very good complement to Glamour. Because one is a very big special wall, and the other is a very big defense wall. Well, not as big, if you know what I mean. I should probably get rid of Carrot Cake. We can train her up later. But she's not going to help against several of the upcoming trials, so... Yeah. Snorlax would be neat. I haven't used a Snorlax in a while. Big service wall. Get a Spinda. I don't know about that. False swipe. All right. Let's go. Fighting Z has use against the Lima. Yeah, that's true. It's just I don't have access to a lot of fighting type moves. Get leftovers with Munchlax. Yeah, I don't want to go as big on a leftover grind as I did in the Sun Nuzlocke Revenge. But I wouldn't mind getting maybe like two leftovers. Like, I'll get a Munchlax. 
Is there are a lot of normal type Pokemon on the second island. There are. There's a lot. There's like Cacleon in the tunnel, which is pretty cool. Wait, am I healed? I think I am. I am! I can wake all my Pokemon up. All right, there you go. Yeah, move tutors. That's what I'm looking forward to, because Lopunny can learn a lot of moves. Like, a lot of the elemental punches. I feel like there will be some really fun things there. Because normal-type Pokemon learn a lot of moves. Uh, let's assign you to that. Let's see if I can find a much Lax. Oh, I should go back and get Thief. That'd be pretty handy. Get a Blissey. I'm thinking. I'm thinking that might be good. Oh, Bonds Lie. That's wild. I don't need Bonds Lie. Although, actually, if you can survive this, maybe you'll call for Happini. Come on, call Happini. That'd be nice. No, I don't want that thing. Uh, how do I want to handle this? I guess I'll knock this one out. Did I get the Soothe Bell yet? I did. It's currently on Sweetie Bun. Oh, this is not good. Sorry, Becky back. That didn't turn out too well for you. Uh, it's alright, though. Let's send out... The uh, shoot. I guess Carrot Cake? For Bite? I'm not sure if that'll knock it out. Oh, Low Kick is gonna hurt. Nice. I just want to see if you'll call a Happini. That'd be really nice. Oh, yeah, here we go. Still handling it. That's nice. Okay, let's send out Glamour. Okay, call for some help. Growl. Come on. So they use an adrenaline orb. Oh, that's right. I forgot they changed that. You're right. They did make that change in Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. They don't call for more than one ally if you haven't used an adrenaline orb. Yeah, thank you for reminding me. I don't think I even have any. Yeah, I don't. All right, I will... Uh, I mean, I'm, since I'm already here, I might as well knock this thing out. <laughs> I've been playing a lot of sun lately, so I'm just very used to that. Hey, level 16. Nice. I'm really glad that they fixed that. I really am, because that was just such a pain having to deal with it. Because, you know, I like the SOS system, but having them call over and over and over again when you didn't really want that is just so annoying. So annoying. So, oh man. Get the 10 carat hill for flying EMZ. Oh yeah, that's right. I get the there really early. That'd be good with my birds. I might need that against Lurantis. Another nugget. Or actually, I think that's the first nugget I've gotten. Alright, well, I guess I should see if I can get Munchlax here. Because that would be great. Bonsly. Ooh, the temptation. The temptation! I should see if it can summon a Papini. We'll go for it. I don't have much to lose. Oh, this is fun. Oh yeah, Rackmanid, that's right. Use it there. Uh, you are not calling for help right now, are you?
Come on. There we go. Show me Happini. Nope. Don't care about you then. I'm actually gonna get out of here. I should heal. I should also have something with false swipe. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go back to heal. So I can get Tauros and Miltank on the next island. That would be kind of nice. Alright, see ya, Iris. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, what else? Spinda. Mm, I don't know about Spinda. Alright, we gotta go... I believe we have to actually go back up here. Whoa! Something was hiding in the rock! Ah, oh, another Bonsly! Oh, you know what? Becky back is actually back this time. Back from the dead! Alright, show me Happini. You didn't do it. It isn't like super common, so it's fine. Uh... Oh, <laughs> hey, what's up? I was meaning to uh, hurt your kid. I'll leave you be. Oh, uh, maybe I should use Roost in the next fight. That'll heal me up without any potions. What is up with all of these Bonsly? There's honestly so many of them. It's kind of ridiculous. All right, I think I'm going to Roost. Not sure if it's also on this island, but Lillipup is on the next island for sure. Yeah, it's not on this island. I don't think, but I know it's on the next one. Rockruff is the dog. Oh, wow. You're calling for help right away. Nope! Let's not do that. Honestly, the main thing I'm looking for is Munchlax, alright? But I figure I do need Happini. And fighting against something that can call it makes sense. Oh, doggo! I don't really want to stick around against this doggo to roost, because otherwise it's just going to use rock throw. Oh, Stuffle's on the next island, that's right. It's like a little bit more than halfway through it, but that'd be really good. I definitely need to Stuffle on the team. Definitely. Seems like a reasonable opportunity to use Roost, right? I actually lost hit points there. Don't know how I feel about that. Here we go again! Oh man. Alright. Oh, I should have used Roost actually against this, but eh. It's all good. Oh. So many critical hits today. Nope! Now the question is, should I use Brick Break against Munchlax? I don't know if I should. It'd be nice if I could finally find one. No, instead I'd just get rats. Well, I guess I do need to roost. Uh, are you gonna quick attack me? Please don't. You didn't, wow. I'm surprised. 
pursuit. Okay, how much is that hitting for? Ten. Well, I guess I'll roost up really fast. Yeah, Munchlax is fairly bulky. It should survive a quick break. Oh, thank you for using focus energy. You can go ahead and focus all you want. Hopefully you focus better without me around, because I'm leaving. See ya. All right, let's see. I just want to find a Munchlax. Can you get a shiny Bond Slide? Please no. Please no. Hey, it's another bird. I don't really want to catch this bird. Simply because I'll just wait. There will be more birds later. Munchlax has a 10% encounter rate. It really isn't 10%. <laughs> it feels like 2%. I've done this before. And it takes an eternity! But I know he fought more than 10 Pokemon. Here we are again! Another Bonsly! Ugh. Okay. Come on. Call for your friend, Happini. You know you want to. Oh, don't throw rocks at me. That's just rude. So rude. So, so rude. It'd be nice if for Roost it looked like they actually roosted. That doesn't really look like... Oh, what the heck was that? Oh, right. I lost my resistance. Oh, come on. No help. Flail. That should be fine. Ooh. There it is. Aw. All right, let's go ahead and get this thing. All right, get out of here, Bonsly. Okay, I gotta be careful with you. Uh, I'm actually thinking Peck might take it out. Well, let's just see if I can toss a Pokeball and maybe get, like, really lucky. I got 25 of them. Oh, so close, you tease. You tease! Yeah, this thing has, like, zero defense, so... Oh, I could mud slap it. I bet you that'd be fine. I might send out your done. Do it that way. Because otherwise this is going to take a while. Alright, you're done. Copycat. Uh oh! Oh no! What did it what was the last oh, sweet kiss. Oh Darn it! Okay, well let's just mud slap, see what happens. Nice. Oh wow, yeah, that's fine. Oh, this is great. Oh, I avoided it. Awesome. Nice! How's a crit? How does Charm miss, anyway? Like, you wouldn't think of it as missing. Does Happini have Lucky Egg? No, it does not. Gee, if only I taught False Swipe to one of my Pokémon, maybe this could have been avoided.
Oh, okay. This is so bad. <laughs> well, at least it's at half right now. I probably have a better chance of catching it. Well, I know I have a better chance, but I think this will be fine. I got plenty of Pokeballs. It's not like it's really an issue. And I have Great Balls. I could just catch it in a Great Ball. I guess that'd be fine. Ooh, actually, what other kinds of Pokeballs do I have? Premier, Heal Balls. Oh, it looked really nice in a Heal Ball. I guess I'll try it. That was all you wanted. You just wanted a fancy ball. All right. All right. Well, that's all right by me. Okay, so what shall I name this thing? Yawn. Ooh, that could be pretty fun. Um, Let's get rid of Mud Slap. Like, it's all right, but... Oh, that's right. I'm going to have to evolve Happiny during the daytime. So I'll probably have to do a little bit of time manipulation, or maybe just do it off screen. All right, well, we got her. Uh, when it sees something round and white, Happiny puts it into the pouch on its stomach. It sometimes becomes overloaded and can't move. Uh, that's cute. Um, what shall we name you? I guess we, we could call her... We, let's call her Joy, you know? Like Nurse Joy, like Nurse Joy's Chansey. Or Blissey. It's just like a nice name, too. Like happiness and everything. Alright, we'll call her Joy. Oh, Joy! Alright, let's take a look at you. Uh, you have... The Oval Stone and Natural Cure, which is great. The nature, it's a lax nature. I guess that's not the worst. You have plenty of special defense to go around, even though it's appreciated. Like, the extra defense does help. So it's not, like, terrible. It's not the best, but it's not terrible. No, oh, that's all right. Oh, you don't even have any attacking moves. That's so sad. Um, we're going to send you to the box. You can hold on to that oval stone, though. Oh, great! That's really nice. We got we got joy. All right, let me go back to the Pokemon Center. Actually, I guess we can run this way. Just on the off chance I run into a Munchlax and these two patches of grass, which we did not. I feel like they made those narrower for some reason. All right. Heal me up, please. There we go. All right, so I think that is actually going to do it for today, everyone. I hope you did enjoy, though. Uh, if you did, definitely be sure to hit that like button. It definitely goes a long way. And lets me know you're enjoying watching my streams. Let me make sure I save as well. Um, but yeah, other than that... I hope you did enjoy it. and we'll be doing more of this, uh, I don't know when, but probably maybe Thursday, I think, because I'll be taking tomorrow off from Facebook streaming, but that's all right. We all need a day to recover, but yeah, thanks so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time, everyone.